Hello, hello, hello. Today is Saturday, April 19, 2025. Here follow the solutions by Keith of problem 228. Electromagnetic wave. And what is very, very nice that Keith spent the time to look where in my lectures and where in my help sessions I dealt with physics related to this problem. Already he mentions right at the start in 803 lecture 13 Walter derives a traveling plane wave solution to Maxwell's equations. Thus for this problem he finds that the speed in the x direction is 1.38 times 10 to the 8 meters per second, which is less, of course, than the speed of light. Therefore, the index of refraction must be 2.17. It is C divided by V. Searching the internet, all I can find is cubic zirconia, zirconium dioxide. And many of my viewers came to the same conclusion. Yes, there are quite a few people who have the correct answers to this problem. My rough guess is more than 15, fewer than 25. And then Keith continues, give more information about cubic zirconia. And he refers to imitation diamonds. Now he goes another step further. In lecture 28 of 802 and 803 lecture 14, Walter discusses the pointing vector, which is S. It is E cross B divided by mu zero. And he shows that for free space, the magnitude of S is E zero squared divided by two mu zero C. This is the average value, by the way, of S. This is the energy absorbed per square meter per second. So in the medium he substitutes the numbers and he concludes about 115 joules per square meter per second. Many of you have that, which made me very happy. Thus energy absorbed per square meter per second is 115 joules. 
But Keats goes one step further. In 802, module 12.03, those are my help sessions, Walter shows a neat way to obtaining the radiation pressure of an electromagnetic wave, electromagnetic wave starting with photon energy. The energy of a photon is PC. Photons have no mass, but they have energy and they have momentum P. And the energy is the momentum P times C. And that leads then to the radiation pressure, the mean value of the pointing vector divided by C. And for the medium, he carries the math a little bit further. 8.36 times 10 to the minus 7 newtons per square meter. Thank you, Keith, for having spent the time to search my lectures and my help sessions where I cover almost everything that is part of this problem. Thank you, Keith. Thank you very much.